Is this not the most beautiful 56 Ford Sunliner there is? It is decked out with goodies, continental kits, spotlights, cattle guards, colors, black with a red and white interior, wire hubcaps, absolutely stunning, loaded up, clean car, older body off restoration. Go to volocars.com and there'll be a price tag on every car. We have about 200 in stock right now. And there's also a monthly finance option as well. We have banks that'll go 15 years, stretch it out, and make, an, a, make a payment that you can afford. But that tops down, let's go for a spin. Yeah, this car is beautiful. I just love it. All the goodies and colors. It's absolutely why I bought it. Uh, so let's check out the body. And you know, it's black, so it's not going to hide anything. And this is all straight, nice. The hood fits beautifully. The fender's nice. Looking down the side, laser straight. I mean, it's really, really clean, straight. No rust, no bubbles down here, no damage. All of this is nice, clean. That door fits beautifully. Quarter panels, straight, clean, no bubbles. The body line is real nice. Fender skirts fit real nice. All this is mint shape. All fits beautifully. No bubbles, no rust, no damage. And it's an older restoration. If something was going to crack or shrink or bubble, it would have done it by now. And this all looks fantastic. The paint doesn't look like an older restoration. It looks like a fresh restoration. Here's a few nicks on the edge. Here's a touch-up that uh, you barely notice. Here's a little chip that should be touched up. Shuts real nicely. So the body's excellent. Straight, fits right, no rust, no damage, no shrinkage. Looks great. Raven Black, that's the code on the tag. Polished beautiful. It's like a mirror. I can read a book in the reflection right here. Not to say there isn't an imperfection here or there. A little chip touched up right along the edge here. So yeah, minor imperfection, but uh, overall it's, it's like black mirror. Hood ornament looks new. The emblems look new. This is a cattle guard, front and back, the big old bumper guard. All of that is shiny and sparkly. Again, maybe there's an imperfection here or there, so we'll call it an eight or nine, but it's beautiful. Stainless moldings, 56 was a little sharper. It goes like this. The 55 like dipped way down and came up. Uh, I like the 56 better. It's sleek. Uh, antenna's got a little bend in it. Dual spotlights, we fixed them. Uh, they both work. Dual mirrors, has the fingernail guards behind the door handles here. Uh, the fender skirts. Cattle guards, look how the exhaust comes right through the back bumper. Reverse lights are an option. as a fifth matching wire wheel hubcap, the metal cover over the tire. All this trim's real nice. Uh, it has the stone shield, rocker moldings, and the stone shields on the front fenders. The mirrors got a little pitting. They're probably reproduction, a little bit of pitting, a little... A little uh, age on the chrome around here. So, you know, some of that is not perfect, but all very nice. And it has the wire basket hubcaps. That's a big improvement. That looks really sharp. And then big old wide white walls are actually radial tires. The convertible top looks very rich when it's up. It's a black canvas top. There's pictures on our website. Uh, it's a power top. We bled the power top system. Uh, each car goes through our shop for a full inspection, and uh, I'll read the list later. But yeah, we went through and fixed a lot of little things, so it's turnkey, ready to go. Let's open it up, check out that beautiful interior. All right, so you have to swing the Continental kit out of the way to get into the trunk. Just lift this lever, open the trunk. Underneath is painted very nicely. His uh, weather strip is real nice and soft. Inside is all nice, clean metal. has the plaid mat. It has the cardboard pillar panels on the side. A white wall spare. has the jack assembly. So it's a nice, clean, complete trunk compartment. 
Do we have buy it now button on every car on our website? If you see something you really like, you click the button, it locks it in for you. There are other 56 Ford convertible Sunliners out there, but not this one. These colors, these options really makes this a standout car. Door jams look very clean. Weather strips look very nice. The interior overall is very good. Uh, all reproduction door panels, handles, trim, all looks real nice. The metals all painted real nice and slick. I uh, see the, the uh, spotlight. That's the handle for the spotlight. Comes right inside the car. A factory instruments, all nice and clean. Quartz movement in the clock. Just look how nice. The dash is important. You're sitting in your car driving. You don't want to look at something that's old and beat up. Heater controls, uh, temperature gauge down below. Because um, the car, you know, it does include one in the dash, but here's an auxiliary. Town and country radio. I honestly don't know if that works. We don't spend too much time on radios, but that was an option. All nice and clean. Here's an original owner's manual. Here's the other spotlight. Uh, nice clean door, uh, kick panels, embroidered mats on top of the nice carpet, reproduction seat upholstery, uh, it's got some seat belts in front. The upholstery is not ripped or torn, it just shows a little bit of age, you know, a few years old. Everything in back looks nice, you got floor mats, the upholstery, the armrest, all really good shape. Little you know, freckling in the chrome right there. Steering wheel was repainted. The horn rings, probably original. Got a little cracking in the plastic. You could easily bring this to the next level with some little items, uh, but I, I think it's just nice the way it is. Is from an estate. We were told it was an AACA judged, you know, winner, but I did not get anything to verify that. So it's the uh, the V8, nice, smooth running. It is a four barrel underneath the big old air cleaner, uh, Thunderbird special valve covers, all nice, clean. Over on this side, it has. The choke tube, it runs heat up to the choke. Plug wires look clean. On the firewall, you have the correct stampings, reproduction hose clamps. Look how everything's run properly. This is the heater blower. Battery is secured. Another reason I like the 56 as a first year for a 12 volt battery. If you buy a 55, you're getting a 6 volt battery. It doesn't crank over as strong, lights aren't as bright. So all nice, clean. The suspension parts look clean. This has power steering and power brakes. Don't take that for granted. A lot of cars back in the day did not have that. It has both. And then under the hood has the insulation pad. Just overall, in general, very nice appearance. So it was a body off frame restoration. I can see the new body, uh, body to frame bushings underneath. The floors are as clean as you'll ever find. The floors, the braces, the rockers, all smooth, clean metal, painted like a semi-gloss black. Um, I said I would let you know what we serviced on this car. I uh, went through our shop, went on a lift, got visually inspected, got driven. Uh, we changed the oil, tuned the carb, set the timing, fixed the wipers, replaced the brake light switch. Uh, we got both spotlights working, replaced the door lock cylinders, so you have working door locks, bled the power top system, lubed and adjusted the hood latch, 
Let's see if they did a good job. They did a good job. Um, bled the brakes. Uh, so we do try and make the cars turnkey, ready to enjoy. The steering and suspension all looks good. You can see the bushings in that. They, they're not old and cracked and falling out. They did put air shocks in the back. It has a polished stainless steel dual exhaust system. Uh, you look up at the motor, it's nice and clean. It has the cruise-o-matic transmission, that looks real clean. Uh, three 22 gears in the back, so there's a tag attached to it. Uh, fuel tank looks uh, more recent. The tank and the straps look real clean. Uh, drum brakes all around, e-brake is all hooked up. Uh, so that all looks really good underneath the car. You can go to volocars.com. Salesmen will help answer the rest of your questions, including how to get it delivered and how to get it financed. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click the bell icon. You'll be notified when the next one's posted. Thanks for watching.